One of the main requirements of any video management solution is to monitor the cameras in the mobile devices. With modern mobile devices equipped with different operating systems nowadays, monitoring the site from tip to toe has become possible even with your smartphones. Matrix Satatya Vision provides such options using which the administrators can view the cameras, playback the recorded files, create views to retain them, etc. Matrix Satatya Vision can be downloaded from Google Play Store in Android phones. In this video, we will learn how to configure Satatya Vision. So let's get started. Open the Google Play Store and search for Satatya Vision. Tap Install to download and install the app. Open Satatya Vision app. Enter the management server IP address in Enterprise Server IP. Enter the port as 8085 which is default media client port. Tap OK. Enter the default username and password as admin and tap login. Check stay signed in checkbox to avoid signing in every time you restart the app. Homepage of Satatya Vision will open. Go to the left panel. In the camera tab, all the recording servers connected with the management server will be shown. Select the recording server to list all the cameras connected with it. Select the cameras individually and tap Start Live View. The live view of the selected cameras will start. There are maximum two layouts supported in Satatya Vision. One is 2x2 two two as shown and the other one is 1x1. One one. This can be set by double tapping the selected camera. To browse through pages, select the page. There are total 256 pages in Satatya Vision. The user can jump upon any page by selecting the page number. Again go to the left panel. Select the recording server then cameras. Tap add to my view. The views already created will be shown in the list. To create a new view, tap add. Enter the desired name of the view and tap OK. Now go to my views. Tap on the created view to start the live view of the cameras added in the same. The main advantage of creating views is to retain the selected cameras in Satatya Vision. This will discard the procedure of adding the selected cameras again and again on app restarts. Again go to the left panel. Select any other view to start the live view of the cameras added in the same. Now go to playback. Select the recording server. Select the camera. And hit OK. Select the date of which the playback is to be seen. Tap play button to start the playback. Swipe right to go further into the timeline. The length of the timeline can be changed as required. If the camera has an inbuilt microphone, start the audio by unmuting. To play the video in reverse fashion, tap reverse button. To resume, tap play button. Tap forward button to play the video a bit faster. To resume, tap reverse button. To go back, tap back button. Now we will see different options for the camera. When the view of any camera is live, tap it to reveal the options at the bottom. To keep the camera added but stop its live view for a while, tap stop video button. The live view will stop. To take the snapshot of the camera at an instant, tap camera button. The snapshot will be saved in the picture gallery. To listen to the audio during live streaming, tap speaker button. The audio will start. To switch between different streams of the camera, tap change stream. Depending on the speed of the network with which the mobile is connected, the streams can be switched. It is recommended to view the cameras on mobile in substream. So select the stream here as live which is set as substream. The substream of the camera will start. 
Let's understand how to select the substream for the camera. To do this, open Admin Client on Management Server PC. Go to Servers and Devices module. Select the recording server. Select the device. And then select the camera. Go to Stream Usage. Select Live. Change the stream from Main to Substream. Click Apply. Setting the cameras and sequencing is also possible in Satatya Vision. Tap Sequencing button to start the sequence. To resume, tap the Sequencing button again. To add the camera in any desired view, tap Add in View. Select the view and tap Add. The camera will be added. Tap Last option to fetch the details of the camera. Now select Additional Options. Go to Settings. Go to Display. Tap Default View to set the view of the cameras. Choose whether to maintain the aspect ratio or to fit to window. Go to Default Mode. Choose the default mode as 2x2 or 1x1. Check Caption Window to see the camera name on the top of the window. Now go to General. Choose the Sequence Time Interval as required. Check Auto Sync checkbox to sync with the database on every login. Finally go to Server. All the details related to server can be fetched from here. It is recommended to select the preferred network as private. Please make sure that the mobile is connected with a high speed internet network. This is a necessity while viewing the cameras on the network. Now go back. Tap Logout to sign out of the Satatya Vision. Go to Help to get instant answers for common FAQs. Tap About to know about Satatya Vision. This is all about using Satatya Vision. Thank you for watching this video.